Hi everyone, Dr. Bruce here. In this video, I thought I would go over the eye anatomy. So most of the eye anatomy here. I'm using one of the 3D models I created and I'll put the link to the model in the announcement. Let's begin with the eye muscle. So there are six eye muscles. Four of these muscles have the name rectus. So there's a superior rectus on the top, an inferior rectus on the bottom, and then a medial and lateral rectus on either side, medial and lateral rectus. There are also two oblique muscles. So this one goes over a little pulley called the trochlea. That's called the superior oblique. And then this one wraps around the bottom of the eye. That's the inferior oblique. Now the eye consists of three layers or tunic and the outer layer then consists of the cornea, which has been removed here and, um, and the sclera, which is number three over here. That's the outer layer. The middle layer then includes the ciliary body, which is number two here, the lens, which is number one here, and the choroid coat. The inner layer then consists of the retina, which is this inner portion inside of this one. So this, a lot of the structures have been removed here. We also have the optic nerve, which uh, carries the impulses from the eye to the uh, occipital lobe via the optic tracts, which are back here. Now where the optic nerve connects to the back of the eye, you have the blind spot. So it's called the optic disc. And this is important because if there's intracranial uh, edema, there's uh, the optic disc pushes out and um, you can see it. There's also the retina here, which is the uh, sensory layer. Uh, that, uh, actually this one's the retina. That's where all the photoreceptors receptors are, the uh, rods and the cones. Number 16 here is the fovea centralis. This one, if you were to, you know, there would be the pupil here and the iris around it, which have been removed. But if you were to look straight back from the pupil, you would see the fovea centralis, which is the area of sharpest vision because it contains the, a high concentration of rods and cones. So a lot of sensory receptors there. Let's see what else. Um, oh, yes. There are two types of fluid in the eye. There's the aqueous humor, which is in the anterior chamber, which is, you know, in front of the lens here. Um, and that can build up and cause glaucoma because there's a, you know, production of it by the ciliary body. Then there's a drainage area called the uh, uh, sclerovenous canal or canal of Schlem. And then uh, there's the vitreous humor, which is a jelly-like substance, which is in, in here, which helps to maintain the structure of the eye. All right, um, I think I told you about the choroid coat, which is this, it's a dark layer that provides contrast to the eye, and I think that's about it. All right, so hopefully this helps with eye anatomy, and we'll see you next time.